ladies and gentlemen, in this spring of 2020, physical distancing. If I could offer you only one tip for the near future, physical distancing would be it. The short-term benefits of this have been proven by scientists, or as the rest of my advice is stuff that we've learned over the past month or so. I will dispense with this advice now. Wash your hands. Don't hoard toilet paper. You now understand the pain of trying to find toilet paper. Trust me, in 20 years, you'll look back at this difficult time and recall in a way that you can't grasp now how ridiculous you really looked by hoarding toilet paper. Be concerned about the future, but don't panic. You know that panicking is as effective as trying to solve an algebra equation by chewing bubblegum. Social isolation is not as difficult as you imagine, or maybe it is. Try to enjoy the time with the ones you are in isolation with. Laugh, binge watch TV shows, sing, learn something new. Don't let your mom cut your bangs. Call your parents or grandparents every day. Call your kids. Wash your hands. Support local businesses. They are there for you now and hopefully will be there when this is over. Don't waste your time browsing the supermarket aisles. Get in, get your stuff, and get out. Celebrate the nurses, the doctors, the first responders, the truck drivers, those that are working for you and serving you during this difficult time. Accept the fact that things will change. Plank this curve. Wash your hands. We are all in this together. And trust me, don't let your mom cut your bangs. <laughs>